All right, lads. I'll give you Blackbeard's honest opinion. You ask me, can this new captain promise you a life of prizes, plunder, and adventure? Aye. For amongst all the gentlemen of fortune sailing these West Indies, he ranks amongst the most clever. There was a time when I thought myself the deadliest scourge of these seas. <laughs> but this man is a fearsome dog that feeds on trouble and turmoil. I seen him clear the deck of a Spanish galleon like it were nothing. Fighting like a devil, dressed as a man. And he's a canny one. <sighs> Knows his way round every crag wow. and crevice of these islands. So if his fortune and adventure you seek, and Captain Edward Kenway's your man. Only, don't meddle in his private affairs. For there's more mystery to that man than even I dare ask. Guys, welcome back. Today we're going to be revisiting the incredible life of Edward Kenway in Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. This was 300 plus years ago. Crazy. Did you see her? <laughs> Find the cannons! How nuts is that? That you're actually going up against a freaking assassin. Reach the ship's wheel. I don't know if we can run right now or what. Oh, there we go. Right trigger, of course. Take the wheel. Oh my god, bro. This looks incredible. To fire the cannons, hold LT and move the right stick to aim and then right trigger to shoot. See, I feel like this is one thing that Skull and Bones was really missing, man. Being able to you know control and don't get me wrong i actually enjoy skull and bones and i don't even like games like that but i feel like it would have been so much more successful if it had some sort of combat you know hand-to-hand -hand combat but then again the game just released so what do, what do i know I, I just really think that it was a bit more enjoyable than i initially thought but nonetheless we're here <laughs> I think we're fine. I don't even, I don't even think we need a brace for this. We'll be all right. Fire! <laughs> oh, and then we got the swivels, of course. This was such a bold move for them to just throw you against an assassin. Is it dangerous? Edward. Hmm? Privateering. Is it dangerous? Wouldn't pay so nice if it weren't. Why not sail with the King's Navy? Earn a proper wage? Sail under gentlemen? Sod the Navy's gentlemen. For every shilling I'd earn, the captain gets 600. That's no way to earn a fortune. We don't need a fortune. It's not about need, Caroline. I want food that don't make me sick. I want walls that hold back the wind. I want a decent life. Wow. H how long would you be gone with these privateers? A year, I reckon. Two at the most. All right. 
No more than two. Promise me. He never promised, did he? I also really enjoyed the flashbacks to kind of show and tell his story prior to. That was really cool. All right, so reach the shore. Man, look at this. Dude, this game is, what, 10 years old or something like that? This is pretty impressive. I mean, it is what it is, you know? All right, so hold R2 to swim faster. We've been doing that, bro. What are you talking about? Oh, shit, bro. The memories. I eventually will be doing a full Assassin's Creed replay through of all of them. I don't know. I just feel like we did one so recently, like two years ago, three years ago. Look at the colors. Fuck. I'm sorry. I'm fanning out here. I love this game. <laughs> Was it good for you as well? Havana. I must get to Havana. Well, I'll just build us another ship, will I? I can pay you. Isn't that the sound you pirates like best? One hundred Eskimos. Keep talking. Will you or won't you? You don't have that gold on you now, do you? <laughs> Bloody fucking pirates! Wow. He was gonna kill him, too. <laughs> I'm on to you, Snakesby! Just incredible. Find the assassin. Take a look at the water here, yo. Come on, mate. We're off to a bad start. All right. I think the first time I played, I spent like 30 minutes trying to get a screenshot. So we're just going to go for it. Let's go up this way. I think they got a little bit of the parkour from AC3 as well. Which I think that's my least favorite assassin, Assassin's Creed. It's 100 leagues or more to Havana. Will you walk that distance? Maybe not. Maybe one of the more recent ones, to be fair. Anyways, we're fully focused here. Playing as Edward Kenway. Life is good, yo. And we're headed over to Havana. That's that's where I was born, so that's always good. I guess that's another like minute detail that just always kind of lingers for me with this game, you know? Getting to see my hometown and shit. It's pretty cool. I'm going to go ahead and unlock one of the uh, sink points here. Surely we can do this with no problem. Yeah. Here we go. The first sink point of Assassin's Creed 4. Leap of faith or what? Leap of faith? Woohoo! <laughs> it's fucking awesome. Oh, look. Oh, get that bastard. I think there's a chest here. Hold up. Is it down below? Oh, hold on. Where is it? Ow! Here it is. Yes. Look at that. I don't even think we need that pirate's stuff anyway. I say that was a pretty nice little come up there. Oh, we've got another one. Hold on just a sec. Oh. A painted shell. I don't know what the fuck we'll do with a painted shell, but I guess if it's important to Kenway, it's important to me. We've got another chest here. Uh-huh. Oh. It's a dead boar? <laughs> Did he kill him? All right, we got some bone. That's... That's good. Bones. I don't know if we ever visit this little island again. I think we do eventually. 
I mean, you can. Obviously, we've got the same points and whatnot, so... It would only make sense that you do. I just don't remember actually coming back here. Maybe you do, actually, now that I think... I don't know, man. I've got terrible memory. Let's get it. So, please tell me in the comments, now that we're playing... Out of all the AC games, what do you rank this one? Where does it rank in your list of AC games? Hmm. Keep your distance. Oh, fuck. Oh, no. Oh, now I gotta kill him. <laughs> he just shot me with a flintlock pistol, that bastard. I will kill you. Nothing will save you now. Fucker. All right, we're gonna be fine, okay? It's gonna be fine. That was his last bullet, and that that's all he has. Or should I say that's all he had? He might have one more. I don't know. God knows I don't remember. So, yeah. I'll be optimistic here. Kill this little fucker. Okay, counter. Hold up. <laughs> okay, this is teaching us the... Uh... <laughs> you call yourself an assassin? You gotta be ashamed of yourself gotta be the worst assassin just got killed by a pirate the creed <laughs> feel bad for the creed who hired that guy senor duncan walpole i accept your most generous offer and await your arrival with eagerness if you truly possess the information we desire we have the means to reward you handsomely Though I will not know your face by sight, I believe I can recognize the costume made infamous by your secret order. Therefore, come to Havana in haste, and trust that you shall be welcomed as a brother. Suma su humilde servidor, el gobernador Laureano Torres y Ayala. Mr. Walpole, let's collect your reward. And just like that, we are now officially an assassin. Find a way to Havana. Find a way to Havana, I will. But that's not it. There's more people here, I think, right? I think there was. Is there a chest somewhere around here? I think it might be above us or... Honestly, maybe even under us. Eh, whatever. Who cares? Oh, there's another sink point right here. Let's get it. Wow, look at that view with the ship in the distance, bro. Get out of here, man. Look at this, bro. Why do we not have more pirate games like this? Why did we ever not get a sequel? That's... Anyways, uh... Right, we got the stealth swim, but I think we've also got a chest in here under the waterfall. That's right. Ooh, somebody was eating good here. Unfortunately, they probably died. Restricted area. Okay. All right, so how do we crouch? Was it... Oh, this is the sense. Yeah, some of the controls in this game are a bit awkward. Free the merchant. All right, so stocking zones. Dense vegetations can be used as stocking zones, which allow you to hide and move undetected. Use them to approach targets stealthily. Something like this. Oh, shit. Well, that's a turtle. Oh, he's gonna shoot him. Oh. I was trying to pay attention to see what was the assassinate button. Over here, stupid. I 
Can I loot the bodies? It's almost as if I've never played this game before, right? Alright, I'm gonna grab this last and final guy here. Before we take on that trio back there. Mm-hmm. There you go. Oh, he's a sniper. We ought to be careful with this dude. Oh, fuck off! I clearly assassinated him. I will right, go ahead and parry your ass. Ugh, off with your head! By God's grace, sir, you saved me. A profusion of thanks. Is that yours? It is my vessel, yes. But uh, here lies its poor captain, and I have no art for sailing. I can pilot her myself, no mind. You don't mean to abscond with my ship, do you? I'm Duncan. Dun What's your name, Duncan. friend? Steed, Steed Bonnet. Well, Mr. Bonnet, let this stay twixt us. But I'm on a secret errand for His Majesty the King, God save him, and I must get to Havana with speed. Ah. Oh. That is a relief, sir. Havana is also my destination. Our ways lie together. Natural allies, then. Ah, you put me at ease, sir. To think I took you for a pirate when you first appeared. Did you? <laughs> yes. You have an uh, uncommon way of handling yourself. Quick and easy, if I may say. Gave me quite a fright. But all things considered, I think it's turned out to be a rather fortuitous day, hasn't it? All right, let's go ahead and get the chest, the treasure. Ch uh, tre uh, never mind, the treasure. Rowboat, I'm afraid we'll have to swim to my ship. Hardly the worst thing to happen. Why, thank you, good sir. Favor. What do we have here? Treasure maps. So find treasure maps on explorers cadavers. They will lead you to a specific place on an island. Dig there and you might find money or plans to upgrade your ship. Select the D-pad on the maps and press Y to open the menu. Okay, the coordinates uh, will lead you to a location and the image will help you find the right spot. This feature is also accessible from the second screen. Um, was it here? Huh. 179. All right, I think this seems to be the bridge. Oh, there it is. There it is. Perfect. It doesn't even give you like a little sound effect prompt or anything. It's crazy. I actually kind of like that. Fifteen hundred, not half bad. Okay. All right, so now we got to go back to the ship and set sail for Havana. Got a nice little pride rock going on here. It's pretty sweet. Can we climb that? We cannot. How disappointing. Oh, the turtle. Are we able to kill the turtle? All right. All right, good. I don't want to kill the turtle anyways. Wait up for me, dude. Don't leave. Because literally, if you leave, I'm fucking dead. <laughs> I will die here. <laughs> you imagine? That would suck. How'd this guy even get on the ship? Hmm. All right. Set sail Welcome aboard, Duncan. out of the bay. She's a modest schooner, but well suited to my purpose, trafficking cargo from my plantation and such. She'll do fine. There's a strong wind now. Let's strike to full, shall we? Hmm. Ghost the gallants and royal! Was there a third person view in this game? I forgot. Ah, there's I think a there was. Of the wind at my hair. Ah, I find a bracing comfort in the feel and smell of the ocean. 
the raw stink of of possibility. That's a top way of seeing it, mate. Alright, that's a dead end there to the right, so we'll go ahead and go left. Man, it's it's just amazing to me how well this game feels for it being such an old game. It really does. by the idea of pirates roaming these waters. Is it a real danger, do you suppose? A possibility. But most pirates stalk the windward passage between Cuba and Hispaniola. Oh, I see. Yes. That is a bustling strait. Oh, beautiful flamingos. But I shouldn't worry about being waylaid by pirates. <laughs> we told, my ship is small, and I have nothing of immense value. Sugarcane and its yields, molasses, rum, that sort of thing. There's not a pirate living who turn his back on a keg of rum. Well, yes. Yes, I suppose that's true. All right, I think we're good. We're going to make a left here at the end. I think once you're in this area, you're not able to go, like, full, full speed. That's probably why we're getting this camera. We're about to find out right now. And out of sail. All right, here we go. Open seas, baby. <gasps> Let's go. Yeah, this game is marvelous. Fucking marvelous. Oh, look at that. Oh, and look at the water, too. Like, that teal look in the water always fascinated me. How freaking nicely done that's been. You're a natural sailor, Duncan. I did a decent trick at the helm some time ago. Duncan. Two years before the mast as a privateer. Dash my buttons. Your life seems a grand one, if I may say. So full of adventure. How marvelous. I've seen my share of strangeness, I. Fantastic work. Very promising. All right. All right. Easy now. There you go. Welcome back. Well, your numbers look good. Now let's make sure we can break your brain, all right? I need you to move your head and look at these lights just here. Look up. Sure, that's easy, right? Yep. That's it. Down. I think one of the first time I ever experienced this was in Halo. When you get, like, you know, your helmet and everything and you put it on and he tells you to look to the sides, look up and down. So far, so good. Let's get you up. Uh, okay. So, welcome to the Sample 17 project. Can I get a kiss? Before you get started, <laughs> Hello. you're gonna need this. I'm alive. There you go. Testing, testing, one, two, three. Hello, bonjour. It works. <laughs> All right, let's take a walk. Your file says you've done some memory research before, but not to this extent, which is surprising. You're very good. The data streams are very stable. I think this is when we had a main, a new main character, right? For, for like our real world scenario, our current day scenario. Impressive. I right? think that threw a lot this of people off. This building is barely six months old, but Abstergo Entertainment has been a studio for a few years, since 2010. Look at that. His maternal grandmother's mother. Maybe you saw Liberation? That was our first title powered by Animus Tech. That was just the tip of the iceberg. Soon, we'll be unveiling commercial Animus servers for the whole world to enjoy. They'll offer passive experiences, of course. Edited versions of real history. But only the exciting parts. And we think we found the perfect subject for our first full-length virtual feature. Caribbean Pirates. So that's your gig. Yeah, so Liberation uh, was the only, is the only Assassin's Creed that we've not played here on the channel. Literally the only minute, one. Okay? Well, thank you, Nancy. Bon journée. C'est bon. C'était prêt. Magnifique. Merci. 
This is for you. The primary tool of our trade. Your communicator. Power it up and give it a look. It's pretty slick. Okay. All right, power it up. All right, it's on. Oh, there we go. A. You might have noticed that security seems a little light around here. That's because your communicator is your key to getting around. Mm -hmm. So it's like my mini map. I like it. Oh, it literally says A right there. My goodness. I'm an idiot. I've got my files. Employee passport. Your passport to success at Abstergo Entertainment. Very nice. Welcome to the team. Time to innovate. Yeah, I'm not going to read all that. You know that, right? I'll read a lot of the stuff. I ain't reading that. that. That looks boring. Hey, girl. Just you, you and I, flashing huh? wireless signal? Okay, never mind. It means you're hooked up to the elevator. I'll let you do the honors. She don't like We're us, guys. We're headed up to the Sample okay. 17 studio. Second floor. She, she don't like us. All right, so select Sample 17 project. Okay. Um, I was not paying attention to her. Here we go. It was B. <laughs> I've been a little bit distracted here. I apologize. You ready? Let's, Let's get go. this. Of course I'm ready. A lot of shady shit happens here too. Always does in Abstergo. If you've played any AC game, it, it always ah, does. There's the boss, Olivier Garneau, our CCO. I'll introduce you. Huh? Bonjour. Salut, Mélanie. Ça va bien? Well, thanks. Have you met our new hire? Just started today. I haven't. Bonjour. What project? Sample 17, the Kenway line. Hey them, Connor. Edward, the pirate. Ah, ar, yar, maybe. <laughs> Very exciting. Welcome aboard. Uh, Melanie, can we talk in your office for a minute? Just let me get this one settled and I'll see you in five minutes. C'est bon. Nice to meet you. So, this is the Sample 17 floor. We're diving into the memories of one very generous donor, Desmond Miles. We're pulling all the best stuff from his DNA, and hopefully one day, we can forge some fantastic experiences from what we find in there. Desmond Miles, that's right. This pair of legs is John, one of the wizards in IT. He's just fixing something for you. Not fixing, calibrating. Calibrating, right. So here we are. Your very own Animus workstation. This is all yours, so sit back, relax, and find us some good footage. If you need any hints or tips, the Animus is loaded with tutorial programs, so you'll have no problems. And I'll check in on you later. Have you pirating? All right, I like it. All right, so return to your Animus. Here we've got a little collectible. I like that. I've always thought that the idea behind this whole Assassin's Creed thing is so cool. They made it so you can basically do everything, you know, within the game. You have Abstergo, which is like you're, you're revisiting the history of humankind. And I mean, they literally can go anywhere. And what is this guy doing? Hmm. Oh, look at this. So he's got more collectibles. He's probably further on or further out into the game. That's pretty cool. Some romance. I like it. What about this guy? Only four statues. He sucks. All right, let's let's get back. Here we go. Let's do this. Welcome to Animus Omega, Abstergo Entertainment's proprietary ancestral memory research tool. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns about how to operate your Animus console, please contact your project supervisor, Melanie LeMay. You have been registered as part of the Sample 17 project. Your primary research target is Edward James Kenway, born March 10, 1693, Swansea, Wales. Calibrations complete. All signs normal. All systems optimal. Extra neurotransmitters activated. Nine, what is it? 1693. That's crazy, man. 
world must have been such a different place back then, huh? Just imagine. I would love to live as a pirate back in the days, just for one day, all right? Just not for more than a week, but at least for a day, right? At most a week. I feel like that would have been really cool just to experience it, obviously. Probably we're not suited for that life. <laughs> Maybe it's just one of those things that always looks better on paper. Uh, lively Havana. I've been here once before. It was a truly awful pleasure. <laughs> Havana, Cuba, 1715. See someone you know. Wow. No, no, no. Just putting on a friendly face. I shouldn't want to be mistaken for a pirate again. Right. Flash rogue like yourself must be cautious. Yeah. Pirates beware. Okay. Mad to think Spain and England were at war two years ago, isn't it? Here I am, bartering with Spaniards like they were my cousins. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing wrong, Duncan. No, it's not <coughs> sand in my hampers. So where's the best squad in town? I'm dying for a quick kip. Or a siesta, should I say. Um, I'm just headed to... Uh, public house now to meet some merchants i could i could show you the way well lead on i love how he calls him duncan i hope you'll tarry a bit <laughs> so stupid i can hang about i might have a drink spend it <laughs> drink <laughs> but they don't take kindly to pirates here do they wonder how many stolen reals bought these men this perch but you don't have to worry, Edward. We are not pirates. We are an assassin. All right? For now, until like 80% of the future of this playthrough. Hola, ladies. You don't know these women, do you? No. They charge money for that kind of privilege. A few dozen reals for every hour of knowing. Keen to meet them? No. Goodness, no. I'm, I'm a married man. A married man of their forte, mate. Man, this is so stinking nice. Aha! Here's a purveyor of personal defenses. <laughs> I should acquire a blade for myself, Duncan, just as you have. This rusty razor's nothing to admire. Even so, I appear a mere kitten walking so close upon you. Perhaps a small dagger would suit me. Let's see what he's selling. Maybe I'll buy a sword, too. We'll both jump rank. Oh, we'll be quite the pair, you and I. Twin devils! <laughs> Lend us a few reals, then. I did save your skin. Ah, oh, uh, of course. Uh, Cheers. Yeah. All right, so buy a pair of swords. Oh, pfft. bro, what are you doing? Looking all sus. Sword sets, pistol sets. Let's go to sword sets. British cutlass, cutlasses. Do we have anything? Oh, wait, but we have these as well. Ezio's swords. Oh. Yeah, bro, I'm probably going to equip those. I mean, obviously they've got, we should have them, right? Oh, whatever, we'll buy these. They're free, anyways. They all for free. For me. How do you fare? I had only enough for a small knife, sadly. <laughs> Still, it'll do in a pinch. Oh, puff a duff. I have led us astray, Duncan. Oh, no matter. I'll get us a better view. What are we looking for? Uh, a tavern, a sort of courtyard interior. Okay. What's the best way to do this? I don't think we can go through here. Let me see. Eh, I was wrong. Of course we can. Wait. Yes. Can I jump that way? Or we can actually go around. Up into this little hole here and then go around here. We could have probably gone through the roof right in front of us. But of course, I'm trying to be... Uh, Every finger's a fish hook. That's how you tell a true sailor. Trying to be adventurous here. Ended up looking kind of stupid. All right, let's go ahead and sync up. Have no fear, Mr. Bonnet. Hold on. Um, God, can't wait. Don't embarrass me. There we go, bud. Welcome to Havana. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I think I see the place. We're not far. Hang tight! Oh God! What are you doing? 
Leap of faith! Stop or I'll break your knees oh, I gotta kill this you. dude. Catch and loot the pickpocket. Okay. You're punk. Is there a way to target a specific... Oh, God. No, 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 no. You robbed the wrong man, mate. Fellow with dangerous friends. Let's go back to Bonnet here. Duncan! <laughs> Duncan! Of course I am. That was no fuss. Oh, yeah. Duncan! We've arrived. Take your time, I'll be just here. Glad to meet no Welshman deep in Dago country. I'm English myself. Biding my time till the next war calls me to service. Lucky King George having a piss pot like you flying his flag. Oh! Oi! Skulk! I've seen your face before. Use mates with them pirates down in Nassau. Ooh. Shut your fucking gob or I'll fill it with shot, you hear me? <laughs> Edward, is it? You recognize this. What are the odds, dude? Hey, I warned him. Oh, fuck, my nose. I'm a sexy pirate, bro. You don't get to touch my nose like that. Oh, wait, what happened to my sword? <laughs> oh, that's right. We can't use swords because then we'll get in trouble here. All right, so to grab and throw an opponent, press B to counter. And press B. Oh my god. <laughs> to counter and wound an opponent, press B. And then press A. Oh my god. Press B to counter, then press X to knock out an opponent. <laughs> oh, there's more. Okay. No problemo. <laughs> Why is this so cheesy? It's so fun. Yeah. Oh, nice. Little roundhouse kick. Oh, damn. Hit him with that pimp slap. So how we backhanded that dude? I don't, I don't know what we're doing. What's going on? Are we okay? Oh, no. You're not leaving me. I'll cut you up. Oh, God. No. What are you? Smoke bombs. There we go. All right, use the D-pad to select smoke bombs and then press Y to use it. Smoke bombs, uh, smoke bombs incapacitate enemies for a few seconds, allowing you to escape or kill them easily. There's uh, a little bit too many of these dudes, so we'll go ahead and... Oh my god, yeah, I was going to try and kill them. Way too many of them. Absolutely not. Hide inside haystacks. And similar objects to become invisible. Come on, Kenway. Where are the haystacks? There's no way they see us here. There's no way. I miss these games where they had like these cluttered rooftops like this. AC2 had a lot of that as well, and it was super fun. Are we good? Oh, escape the area and oh, I gotta escape. I'm an idiot. I gotta escape the red area. Oh my goodness. Alright, no problem. We're good. Mission complete. Likely Havana. Optional objectives. Tackle the pickpocket. Oh, I could have just tackled him. Damn, I actually killed his ass. That was terrible. <laughs> There's a chest right here. It's a golden one, too. That sounds pretty damn nice. Let's go ahead and loot that before we get spotted. Ivory wheel. Now available at the captain's cabin. Love it. Hey, ladies. Here he is. Sorry about the swift exit. Bit of a misunderstanding. One heap to put another. 
Oh, Jesus. I'm sorry, mate. This is my doing. I'm only trying to keep these Spanish eyes off me. Oh, it's no bother. Regrettably, the soldiers confiscated my sugar. But when your dispatches. Damn! And where'd they gone? Haven't the foggiest idea, I'm afraid. I suspect those chaps might, but my Spanish is muy mal dad, so I... I'd rather not ask. Shit! All right, come on, let's follow them and recover my maps. And my sugar? What, in my drawers? Hmm. We'll see what happens. All right, so use Eagle Vision to keep the target. What? Eagle Vision allows you to spot interesting elements. It highlights animals and enemies in red and targets and objectives in gold. Press the left stick to use your Eagle Vision. Note that Eagle Vision cannot be used while running. Okay, while using the Eagle Vision, you can tag up to 10 enemies or animals by just looking at them. Once tagged, an enemy can be seen through walls, even when you stop using Eagle Vision. That's right. Alright, so we've got the targets. Oh, that's right. This is a really good Eagle Vision. Tell the guards. What is this guy doing? That's right. They're gonna look back every so often now. The best idea you had today. <gasps> okay, I'm camouflaging right here. Alright, let's go into the haystack possibly. Or maybe not. Maybe just go up here. They won't spot us up here. Look at these dorks. I can assassinate them right now. Oh my god. They almost just saw me. Buenos dias, senores. You're late. Yes, sir. See, uh, we are very sorry. Our captain delayed us. Huh. Alright, they're going in here. Interesting. Ah. This would be Captain Mendoza? Yes, sir. He's very excited to meet you. Only he must be present for a, a, a hanging, senor. Hanging. A uh, hanging. Ah, I love a good hanging. Yes, sir. Very nice. If we hear the bell, we may go. If you like. Let me take this guy out. Excuse me, sir. You don't mind dying real quick, do you? I'd love to. Especially if Captain Mendoza's fully in the trap. The man owes me money for the slaves I sold him. Of course, sir. Captain Mendoza is happy to pay you. We have goods to sell, sugars and such. Excellent. Yeah, the sugar you stole, punk. Fucking bastard. Oh, there's a cat there. Probably best taking this guy out. Perfect. Alright, they're running. They're running. They're running. Aw, oh, shit. Oh, I know you don't have to do this through the rooftops, but I feel like, I don't know. I find it... I don't think I've ever done it on foot by the bottom truthfully might be easier i don't know maybe we're we're fine we're fine oh god okay now we fucked up Wow, my gosh. Bro, they are running fast. Will you guys calm down? What is your problem? Oh, they're bucking it. <laughs> they're going so fucking fast. Wait, I gotta be inside the, uh... Yikes. Hurry, hurry, hurry. 
There we go. Excuse me. How long will this hanging take, man? Tell me to hang about all day for the captain. Quick as anything, sir. Captain Mendoza needs only to hang the man, then he will deliver your payment. I don't want the alleys, mind. I want goods, things I can sell, tobacco, rum, sugar. Much fine sugar. Great, we took off a fat Englishman last night. Hmm. Englishman. For el delito de motín contra su capitán, el tribunal sí. de sentencia. Sí. Sugar from Barbados. Very fine. We hold it in the Castillo after the man started the fight last night. He ran, left his sugar behind. Very fine. What's a star? Excuse me. Fly a company up to the Castillo. Oh my god. No, sir. Captain Mendoza will have it sent to you. <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Good lord. Is that big brute your Captain Mendoza? We're good here, right? We ought to be no, good. Sir. He is El Tiburon. El Tiburon, Governor Torres' man. <laughs> Alright, so I gotta follow now El Tiburon. Okay. Tell the captain. <laughs> Thankfully, I've bought myself some ladies. You know? So we ought to be just fine. I don't need to distract anybody. No. No. Don't do anything stupid. Let's go. Let me not run. All right? This guy's not running. There's no need for me to run. It is stupid for me to run. He's going to go in there. Animus Database. Castillo San Salvador. De la Punta. Oh, I like it. Alright, we can I go in there, so. Let them have it. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? Steal the key. Oh my god, he didn't see me. What an idiot. Hey, bud. Remember me? Of course you don't, because you've never seen me. I'm an assassin. Alright, now, there's got to be a different way in there. If I remember correctly. Restricted area. Okay, the ladies are... Doing their job. They did actually a phenomenal job. And I think there was a way in this place. Right through here. Yes. Uh, this is good. Man, look at look at the water in this game. It is so oh, I can't get enough of it. It's so beautiful. Oh, I forgot there was a sniper up there. Fucking asshole. Okay, hold on. Maybe this is not the right way. Uh, he doesn't seem here, does he, huh? He thought he was doing a good job sniping, but unfortunately, Edward Kenway is here to ruin the parade. I'm here to kick some ass. Uh, we've got to be careful. I uh, probably should have pinpointed those guys. Should have marked them up. They're up top, though. Oh, my God. We would have been in so much trouble. Oh, my God. He's coming this way. Fuck. All right, can I pick up the body? I forgot. Of course you can. <laughs> what sort of stupid question is that? See you later, dude. All right. Hey. Hey. 
All right, let's go ahead and pick up. Oh, no. Pick up. All right. I guess I'll loot him first. Take his money, then throw him away. Exactly. I don't even know. We might we might get spotted by throwing that body there. Kind of like in the open or whatever, but. What is this? Ignite? I don't want to ignite that. What happens if I ignite that? I really did forget, I promise. I'm trying to be a good assassin here. <gasps> Come here then, stupid. Hurry up, Kenway. Hurry up. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. I was supposed to go out the window, I think. <laughs> Fuck. Pick up the body. Hurry up. Right, this wall here should cover us relatively good. We ought to be just fine. Have no fear, Steed Bonnet. I've acquired the merchandise, kind of, sort of. I'm on my way. It's the least we can do for the guy. He did bring us here, right? And he didn't charge us. Fortunately for him, he didn't know how to steer his own boat, but his own ship, excuse me. What's going on over there? Is he glitching out or what? <laughs> what is happening to him? Oh my god. Shush break. Look at him. <laughs> Sorry about the sugar. I've only one pair of hands. Oh, it's no great loss. Uh, I've got uh, plenty of cargo here to make a profit on my trip. Will you stay here long? For a few weeks, yes. Then back to Barbados to the tedium of domesticity. Don't settle for tedium. Sail for Nassau. Live life as you see fit. <laughs> Haven't I heard that Nassau is crawling with pirates? Seems a very tawdry place. Not tawdry, liberated. Oh, God. That would be an adventure. But no. No, I'm a husband and a father. I have responsibilities. Life can't be all pleasure and distraction, Duncan. Hey, our bonnet. The name's Edward, in truth. Duncan's only a handle. Mm. Ah. Secret name for your secret meeting with the governor. Mm -hmm. The governor, right. I think I've kept him waiting long enough. Mission two completes. So funny enough, dude. Um, I guess it's not funny at all. I don't even know why I'm saying that, but it's crazy. Like you hear these people, I'm a father, I'm a husband. And back in the days, and till this day, people still do it, but you got to do what you got to do to earn a living, right? And it's like, imagine these people were pirates or whether it be pirates or, or, or you know, just regular people back in the days that have to sail for many, many months and months and months, and they don't get to see their family. That's crazy. That must be so depressing. Wow. I mean, I understand a couple of weeks, but these people were like a year, half a year. Maybe more? Fuck. And no way of communicating, okay? So nowadays, you can at least call. Back then, it was just like, I'm gone. I don't know you. Don't call me. You can't call me. Oh, we got some sugar cane. I remember in Cuba, we used to go out and uh, when we were kids, it was like a sugar cane farm. And we would take them from the sugar cane farm and we'd eat them just like that. They're really hard to eat, but you gotta like blend them and make something called guarapo, which is really good. Some people might not like it, but if you're Cuban, you probably do. All right, so we've officially come across the governor's location. I actually came here and synced up. And so we're gonna hit him with a good old leap of faith. Cause we gotta start this mission in style. You know, I still have to think of a game that and I'm sure there is a couple out there. I just can't think of one right now. But when you think of Assassin's Creed, you've got the leap of faith. It's such an iconic thing within the game, right? 
I don't know. Something so simple, but yet so iconic. Mr. Uh, Walpole, was it? I presume. All right, whatever. Let's just start. Buenos dias. Mr. Duncan Walpole of England to see the governor. I believe he is expecting me. Si, sí, señor Walpole. Entre, por favor. Walpole. 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 Hey, yes, it is I, Duncan. Duncan Walpole. <laughs> ¿Ese es el hombre? El... ¿Cómo lo llamabas? ¿Asesino? Sí, Duncan Walpole. Debería haber llegado hace muchos días. No me gusta que los extranjeros se paseen por nuestra ciudad. No me fío de ellos. Cállate. El gobernador tiene invitados. Todos franceses e ingleses. Parece un hombre rudo. Le suponía un respeto más... respetable. Llévame ese en alta mar. Sé indulgente con él. I said this the first time I played it, and I'll say it again. Knowing Spanish and listening to them talk in Spanish, like under their breath or whatever, is so cool. This guy's an asshole, so who cares? <laughs> Good morning, sir. Would I be correct in thinking you are done? I am indeed. I thought as much. Woods Rogers. A pleasure. The same. I must say, my wife has a terrible eye for description. Hmm. I'm sorry. My wife. You met her some years ago at the Percy's Masquerade Ball. Ah, quite. She called you devilishly handsome. Obviously a lie to stoke my jealousy. <laughs> <laughs> Julianne, our guest of honor has arrived, Mr. Duncan Walpole. Ah. <laughs> Julian Ducas. <laughs> I hope your conversion to our order is an honest one. I have no love for assassins, but even less for liars. I have not come to disappoint. <laughs> Up for a bit of sport, Duncan? The old man isn't ready just yet. Hmm. This is when we learn how to use the pistol, I You've think. You've got my two best pairs of matched pistols, Duncan. So handle them with care. If I had eight, I'd treat each as my own son. Pull off a few shots if you like. Get a feel for it. <laughs> I once fought beside a man who carried nine on his person. They were a boom in room, but hindered his ability to shoot. Sadly. <laughs> Quite. I like the kick, yes? I long for the day where one firearm carries four bullets, and not the opposite. Press Y to shoot the highlighted target. What? Press Y? Oh, so you don't have to aim. Of course. James Puckle. But I like to aim. It's cool. And what happened? What? Hello? What just happened? I don't know what just happened back there. But it happened. Press LB to reload your gun. I long okay. for the day where one firearm carries four bullets, and not the opposite. It's like my whole computer just crashed out of nowhere. Magnifique. Magnifique. Uh, that's more targets? What? Sure? No? Talk to the hosts? Duncan, where are your wrist blades? I've never seen an assassin so ill-equipped. Ah, damaged mm. sadly beyond all repair. Uh-huh. Have your choice. Where did you find all these? Oh, <laughs> that's right. I did not find them. I took them. These are souvenirs. That's right, we never had the freaking... Oh my goodness, how could I forget? Two blades, as is the custom, eh? Custom, no. I. Don't yes, you now we got the hidden blades. Demonstration of your techniques. Well, uh, we must. 
We put together a training course in anticipation of your arrival. It would be a shame to leave here without seeing you in action. Yes, of course. Well, I mean, if there is time, I would gladly uh, show you what I know. Yes. <laughs> you see, the situation is well suited to your skills. Have a go. A blade in a crowd is always the simplest. Nothing grandiose, just quick and clean. Always have loved the uh, the way the game's put in the tutorials. It's just so cool. This guy knows, knows nothing about being an assassin, by the way. The perfect example of a poser right here. Ugh, that's how it's done, boys. <laughs> Quite ingenious to use bales of hay for cover, don't you think? All right, here we go. Should I do from the drop? No. Just go here. Show them how it's done. <laughs> God, that's the spirit. Secrecy. The advantage of surprise cannot be overstated, isn't that so? Especially around a blind corner. Hmm. That is so. Perform various assassinations. <laughs> so we'll come here. Just like that. That's how it's done. Yes. Very clever. Your aerial kills have a poetic beauty. Despite their conspicuous quality. Would you show us? It's kind of like, uh, like they know something, you know? It's always giving me the impression like they know something's weird. Something's off. Yeah. Like that? Magnifique. Magnifique. Is it also possible to deliver a killing blow at high speed? Bro, everything's possible if you just believe. Bon Dieu, such a powerful strike. Fascinating. Are we good? Let's continue, the shall we? The assassins have trained you well, Duncan. You chose a perfect time to leave them behind. At great risk, I imagine. Betraying the assassins <clears throat> is never good for one's health. <clears throat> well, neither is drinking liquor, but I am drawn to its dangers all the same. And what is your business here, sir? Are you an associate of the governor's, or a pending acquaintance like myself? Guns, blades, cannons, grenados. <laughs> Anything that may kill a man, I am happy to provide. A smuggler of sorts. And how is your wife these days, Captain Rogers? Is she, uh, here? In Havana? I trust she's well, but I wouldn't know. I've been in Madagascar some 14 months hunting pirates. It took some work to dislodge the criminals there, but we managed it. In future, I hope to use these same tactics throughout the West Indies. And how did you deal with that kind? Very simply. Most pirates are as ignorant as apes. I merely offered them a choice. Take a pardon and return to England penniless, but free men. Or be hanged by the neck until dead. Oh. I imagine Nassau would be your next target. Very astute, Duncan, indeed. Best of luck with that. Hmm. Grandmaster Torres! Mr. Duncan Walpole has arrived. See. Si. You were expected one week ago. Apologies, Governor. My ship was set upon by pirates. We were scuttled. I arrived only yesterday. Unfortunate. Forgive my caution, but were you able to salvage from these pirates the items you promised me? Uh, yes, sir. I was. Hmm. Incredible. The assassins have more resources than I had imagined, but not nearly enough to deter us. It is a pleasure to meet you at last, Duncan. You are most welcome. Come, gentlemen. We have much to discuss. Convened at last, and in such continental company. England, France, Spain, citizens of sad and corrupted empires. 
but you are Templars now. The secret and true legislatures of the world. Please, hold out your hands. Mark and remember our purpose. To guide our wayward souls till they've reached a quiet road. To guide all wayward desire till impassioned hearts are cool. To guide all wayward minds to safe and sober thought. By the Father of Understanding's light, let our work now begin. It's crazy. This guy's an assassin, a Templar, decades ago, and a pirate. The council entrusted me with the task of locating in these West Indies a forgotten place our precursors once called the Observatory. See here. Look up on these images and commit them to memory. They tell a very old and important story. For two decades now, I have endeavored to locate this observatory, a place rumored to contain a tool of incredible utility and power. It houses a kind of armillary sphere, if you like. <laughs> a device that would grant us the power to locate and monitor every man and woman on Earth, whatever their location. Only imagine what it would mean to have such a power. With this device, there would be no secrets among men, no lies, no trickery, only justice, pure <laughs> justice. This is the observatory's promise, and we must take it for our own. Do we know its whereabouts? We will soon, for in our custody is the one man who does, a man named Roberts, once called a sage. It has been 45 years since anyone has seen a true sage. Can you be sure this one is authentic? We are confident he is. The assassins will come for him. Hmm. Indeed they will. But thanks to Duncan and the information he has delivered, the assassins won't be a problem for much longer. All will be made clear tomorrow, gentlemen, when you meet the sage for yourselves. Until then, let us drink. Let us find the observatory together. For with its power, kings will fall, clergy will cower, and the hearts and minds of the world will be ours. Mission completes. Man, I don't even know if I've ever pickpocketed those uh those other dudes. I was actually kind of scared I was gonna get caught, and then I saw that it was an optional objective, but that's hilarious. Rest well, Duncan. Tomorrow the treasure fleet arrives, and with it, your reward. After <laughs> which we will discuss further schemes. Yeah. I look forward to it. Excelente. Meet me down at the docks first thing tomorrow morning. Damn, they kicked my ass out. Request your presence at the docks near the Castillo. First thing tomorrow morning. Okay. I was actually looking forward to uh, to grabbing some of the chests in there, but fuck it. Come here, punk! Oh god! Oh, oh, you messed up big time! Oh god! What? Why am I being chased? I'm trying to do God's work here. Did we tackle him? Where is he? What the fuck is this? What is go You guys you guys gotta be shitting me, huh? Alright, there we go. This guy just kept going in circles. Oh now they're shooting me with guns? Oh my god this is some bullshit they saw me slightly above the rooftops and they decided to attack me i was just talking to the governor i'm a templar damn it good morning duncan just over here edward hello edward i found a man to purchase my remaining sugar huh? quite a coup i must say he just called you edward 
Oh, that's the merchant who sailed me here. Out of caution, I gave him a false name. Yo. Ah, well done. We'll catch up on it later. Yeah. Very punctual, Duncan. This way. Here he is. A man both Templars and assassins have sought for over a decade. I am told your surname is Roberts. Is this so? You recognize this, I think. According to old tales, the blood of a sage is required to enter the observatory. We have the key. Now we need only its location. Perhaps Mr. Roberts will be eager to provide it. Transfer him to my residence. Such a fuss over one man. Is the observatory really such a grand prize? The assassins. The observatory was a tool built by the precursor race. Its worth is without measure. Precursor race? I see. So One cool. of your early letters mentioned a desire to kill the Mayan mentor, Atabai. Were you able to carry out this contract before coming here? I... I was not, no. Too many complications along the way. A pity. But the maps you delivered with the blood vial will see that job finished. Aye. That's the idea. I love I how like you see the assassins running around. Something is wrong. So Stay close, sick. Grandmaster. I feel it too. Do not let them get their hands on the sage at whatever cost. Assassins! Alright, so we gotta defend. Use pistols in Above. combat. They're on the rooftop. Damn, I gotta kill my own people. Yeah. Thankfully, we've got guns and shit. Oh, God. Hold on. Pull Wait, pull out the sword! Break the defense. Use your guns, Edward. Edward, reload. Use your gun. <laughs> why? Why didn't I kill him? <laughs> okay. Oh, he tackled me. That bastard. I'm so sorry, brother. But I'm not really an assassin. Oh my god. Yo, they're relentless. So cool. When you look at them from the other side, they're just so fucking. They're scary, man. Assassins are scary. We do have an option. You're a nimble Actually, one. I'll give you that. I don't know if I want to do all that. If I can, but tackle from above. He's already above. What do you mean, bro? Maybe just go a little bit higher. It's gonna drop down eventually, right? Yes. Hang back and make this easy on both of us, mate. Honestly, whenever I can tackle him, I'll tackle him. Bro, he's fast. Stop, or I'll kneecap you. I'll <laughs> kneecap you. What? <laughs> what? You want to press B? Are you kidding me? Should I grab him? Should I wait till he's down? Ah, fuck it. This guy's pissing me off. Well done, lap dog. Quiet. We'll see him to the prisons, Grandmaster. Double the watch. Well, I'll be buggered. What an active day we've had, gents. See, we set on all sides by our enemies. We must be more cautious. I do wish I could remain to see our drama done, but I must avail myself of these winds and sail for England. By all means, Captain, speed and fortune to you. <laughs> With luck. Return myself a governor, and with my idiot king's blessing, no less. 
Adios. As for you, Mr. Walpole, I consider this the first payment in a long-term investment. Gracias. Obliged. I would like you to be present for the interrogation tomorrow. Call around noon. Yes, sir. Mm, the interrogation, you say. <laughs> I don't know if I want to be here. I am kind of rich now. God, sink me for this pittance. One thousand reals for those maps. That's what? A hundred pound at most. How's a man supposed to become rich in these times with a miser like Torres running the world? Have you ever, um, have you ever worked on a plantation before? You know what I'm thinking? I'd like to see this observatory the governor is going on about. He said it were like a device that could follow people around and show where they were. <laughs> a ludicrous idea. Imagine my wife with such an advantage over me. And imagine what a thing like that would be worth. Sell that to the right person and I'd be the richest pirate privateer in the West Indies. <laughs> I'll catch you up on it. There's a sage in that house I must speak to. Hmm. Private. You didn't hear us say pirate. We're good. Anyways, ob optional objectives. Stay out of combat. Kill guards from... Okay. Stay out of combat. Oh, God. I don't know if I want to do all that, bro. I don't know if that's... I kind of like combat. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead and equip... The hidden blades. Drag his little sorry ass into the bushes. Can I do one of these too? Yes. <laughs> you saw that bonnet? I'm quite the assassin, huh? You like it? I like it. Oh, hold on. Hello. Don't mind me. Just coming through here. You know. Walking by, passing by. Hmm. You know what they say. Hey, is for horses. Oh. <laughs> He's not even listening to my whistle, is he? I I'm, I'm gonna just let him go by. And then I'm gonna kill his ass. Oh damn, we almost got into some combat there. That would have that would have been bad. Excuse me. I'm only here for the treasure. Killing you is just uh kind of in the way. But at the end of the day, I am a pirate. And my main objective is. Oh, hold on. When you are in a hiding spot or at a corner on a stalking zone, press... Okay, to whistle. Oh, this is the guy that's got the key. Oh, shit. I gotta be careful. Come here. If I kill him in the tall grass, we will not be spotted. So. That's exactly what we shall do. Go ahead and loot him. Probably ought to get used to our... Should probably try practice looting after every kill. I don't know if eventually with upgrades... He... Oh, crap. With upgrades, I don't know if he eventually... Kind of loots the uh, enemy bodies automatically. Hey. Guess what's around the corner? <laughs> Death. Death. Oh, yeah. Right, we got that dude over there. He's gonna see me, so I think I'm just gonna. Oh, hold on. I've got to be careful. I can I can assassinate this guard, but it's gotta be when nobody's looking, you know. Do we also get double assassinations here? I don't remember. Yes. Oh my god. Okay, we gotta get a little bit 
further up ahead. Should I go up on the trees already? I think it's time, right? Yeah. This is AC3 right here. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. There's a sniper. Bro, I'm pro you come on, really? The best option would have been to go to the watchtower, kill that watch guy, the, 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 the lookout, and then go through those branches all the way across. That would have been the perfect thing to do, which kind of debating at the moment. Or we can just do this. Exactly. There's a guard coming. But he does not see me. He does not see me. I am behind a wall. And now he's dead. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's fucking hilarious. Alright, so we're here. We're gonna go ahead and free the sage. I can't run now for some reason. That's weird. Piss off. Bianco Pov Pizzo. Where is the sage? You set him free. I had nothing to do with that. Much as I wish I did. Take him to the ports. Send him to Sevilla with the treasure. Oh, short lived. Oh, wait now. I delivered your treasures, didn't I? You did, yes. But you robbed us of Duncan Wallow. <laughs> Damn, I forgot we got caught so quickly on. Despicable display. This Tuspot is a ruined man, Caroline. Unfit for life on land, much less at sea. If he goes to the West Indies, it's you who'll suffer. Father. Father. He Come was love. right. Up with you now. That old muckworm. He's wrong about me. I hope it's so. You believe me, don't you? Can you not see me? Standing out there on the deck of a ship that's sliding into port. And there I am, a man of quality. With a thousand doubloons spilling from my pockets. Like drops of rain. I can see it. Notice how in these flashbacks he's got no tattoos. So he's already deep into this life. Oh, I remember this. Yeah. You hungry? Oh, yeah. Damn, that was easy. <laughs> Some sugar canes. Well, that's quite delicious. Now, what's your plan, mate? Find a weapon and steal a ship. Oh. All right, we've got to be mindful here. I'll take this guy out. Knock his ass out. Yes. So we got to find our gear, which obviously is it's got all the, the goods. It's got the hidden blade. Can we loot these bodies? Yes. This might come in handy. Not a whole lot, but hey, something is something. Come on, bro, over here. Excellent. All right. Did he just go over there by himself? He took two of them out? I think the hidden blade is in the wrong hands. This guy's a monster. Wait, I'll just do... I'll do the dirty work. I'll go ahead and loot them. Alright. <laughs> Actually, he's doing the dirty work. I'm just here taking the money. 
That's the definition of a true pirate. Come on, man. I thought, I thought you had my back. Okay. Took a little too long back there. <laughs> what the fly me? Christ, oh. the seas are uneasy today. Hurricane coming. Hurricane. Jesus. Are we good? Yes, this is our stuff. Perfect. We're stealing a bridge. Hey, take what you need. It won't be a minute. Yes. There's many prisoners held on these ships. Set them free, and they'll sail with us, no question. This guy's such a great supporting character. I love him. And his DLC idea, was... Then. Free what men we can. And find a fast ship to flee it. Aye, there's a brig in this fleet. I'll make my way to it. Nice. Okay. So. Wait, what? Oh my god, I thought I got spot. I mean, we did get spotted, but. Should I go up top? No, I don't think we can. I think it's too high up. Alright, I'm gonna take this guy from the back here. Just gonna whistle at him. Oh, because there's multiple ships. So. Alright, so once we get that, that's, that secondary objective, I think we're good. Okay, never mind. Well, never, never mind. Let's just go full like Rambo here. <laughs> Whatever that was, I don't know. Where's, oh, it's the guy up top. Okay. When I was looking, I'm like, what is that? There's like a little enemy on the map, but I don't. There's a catch to this favor. You're sailing with me. I follow you to hell for this, mate. Bro, it's so fucking cool. Like this whole, the whole premise of this game is. All right, so we gotta, we gotta. Okay. I think we can jump through here, right? If we go straight forward. Look at how cool this is, bro. Look at this. Hiya! <laughs> oh, you actually, uh, you missed me there. I just thought I'd let you know. I'm trying to hit the Y button for the gun, but I think Edward Kenway had different plans. Let's go ahead and grab some ammo. Did I reload this thing or what? Ah, uh, that's probably why. Was it not reloaded? I don't I don't know. It's been a long time. It's been a while. Come on, lads. If we're to drown today, it won't be here. Alright, how many prisoners is that? Alright, I think one more ought to do the trick. Perfection. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Do you mind dying real quick? Look at all the fucking. Oh, look at all the prisoners in the water. Que se ahoguen. Oh, that's fucked up. Fuck it. There is double assassinations. Yes. To complete that. 
Bro, the pistol in this game is so fucking awesome. Sorry, boys. <laughs> Edward Kenway is a badass. Does this count as six prisoners or? There's a brig nearby just waiting for us to take her. Do I need to do another ship? Let's see. Yeah, this, this only counted as like two or whatnot. So we still got to do the other ship. Fuck. You know what? Fuck it. Let's go for a swim. Woohoo! Just gonna be this one here. We got a ladder as well. They're all just floating. You guys are not scared of sharks. Not not one bit. Alright. Let's go up here. Take take the ladder. There we go. Hey, uh, uh, what happened? You know what? I've already got everything I've, I've needed, so there's no need to be stealthy. He called me a perro sanoso. That's, that's pretty insulting. That's like calling me a dog with rabies or some shit. <laughs> These guys are relentless. I don't know why, but insults in Spanish are a lot crazier. Off with your heads. Where are the prisoners? Oh, we gotta go inside. Guys, come on, let's 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 get this party started. Come on, do it again. Do it again. Yeah. Yes. Funny because once you start getting these combos rolling, it's like he's almost unstoppable. Here they are. There's a whole lot of them. I think it's four. We're going topside. Be ready. Well, that's all we need. We needed four more. Good. Let's get the hell out of here. We got the optional objective as well. Oh, now they're fighting back. <laughs> so that's the ship we're gonna take, huh? Yes, I like it. Loving this pirate journey here with you guys, man. Excuse me, sir. Are you the captain here? Not anymore. <laughs> I'm the captain now. You understand? Boom. I don't know what happens if I just start riding the ship or sailing the ship, but I really want to kill these dudes. I cannot believe, I think it was IGN that said it way back when, or some, one of the review companies, that there was too much water and too much sailing in this game. Lay aboard, lads. Save your singing for Davy Jones, you juggabots. It's a hard wind coming. The man speaks true. You lot way anger. As for the rest, half of the foremast and half of the main. Let's outrun this hurricane. So cool. Which I do get it to some extent. Like, there is a lot of sailing, but... See, they don't give us trouble. They were Sca far too slow escape for the this fleet. Weather. All right, so here we've got uh, cheats allow you to re replay missions with uh, interesting modifiers. No, I'm, ain't nobody trying to cheat here. What sort of shit is that? Fire! Mark any orders you think Maybe we ought to just escape. We're up against it here. These men know their place. They'll see us hold. Yeah, we probably should just escape. These fire barrels. Ah! Alright, so that's when they get close to them. Look out, man! Oh! I see it. Wait, 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 wait. The rogue waves. They can be devastating for your ship. Face them up front to get no damage. Okay, 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 okay. No, charge, charge! Oh my god! 
Okay, we're good. Steer clear of that thing. All right, we're good. Yeah, I don't think we we're able to kill all those other ships or kind of like defend ourselves against all those ships. There's a whole lot of them. We probably can. I think it would have been a waste Water of time. Spot, Got a fat tornado here. Wow. Race. Oof. <laughs> oh my god. Oh shit. Let's go left. I think right now it's the wrong. It's not the time to do that. Let's just keep going. I think we're out of it. Yeah, just like that. We are out of it. Nice. That was pretty intense, dude. Shit. Look at us go. We got our own ship now, our own crew. We're assassins, kind of, sort of. Life's pretty good. Life is pretty good. Look at that. Oh my God, we pulled this one straight from the teeth of Neptune. I'm Edward. Much thanks for your aid back there. Adewale. Ever been to Nassau, Adewale? Not yet. Not yet, he said. By God, she took some knocks, didn't she? I think I'll keep her. All hands off, lads. We're taking this one home. Mission six complete. Another hundred percent, not half bad. I've made my choice, Addy. I'm calling her the Jackdaw. A sly bird I loved as a child back in Swansea. A dark little creature, no? Did it rub you wrong when I took this brig as mine own? <laughs> it was the sort of rub I have learned to enjoy, sailing among faces of such fairness. It's true. Most of these men wouldn't accept you as a captain. So what fair role would complement such unfairness? I'll be your quartermaster. Nothing less. All right. And as quartermaster, have you any immediate counsel for this Tyro captain? Rest and repast would do us good before Nassau. Water for drinking. Hunting for food and repairs. Well reasoned, sir. Hunting, it shall be. We'll find a decent place to drop anchor. Mm. I spied a few items in the hold earlier. Powder and a few pistols. I think I'll fashion a second holster if I can. <laughs> It's a good start. One you find laughable. Could we talk a moment about the condition of the ship? What's the trouble? I had a walk about the gun deck this morning and couldn't stand for what I saw. A clutter of lint stocks heaped like tinder and one with a slow match still burning. Christ. And just nearby, two barrels of gunpowder closer than man and wife. Fit to explode at the touch of a spark. We'll stow ours good and proper. As for the cannons, they might as well be tossed. <laughs> Clogs touch holes in need of scraping corrosion on the bodies, barrel swabs as naked as knives, and breech ropes so rotted, I could use them for knitting yarn. The short of it is, we need good equipment kept in fine condition. But we cannot win every battle with snares and shout. 
So worry about your own armaments when it suits you. But don't forget about your jackdaw as well. No, indeed. We'll make it a point to keep this ship and its crew in fine condition. All right, so we got to set sail to... Is it that island over there? All right, it's not that far off. Oh, we gotta be, gotta be careful with these ships. Okay, here we are. Oh god. I don't, I don't think there was like a docking or anything in this game. I think you just, at least in these islands, you just gotta set. Let me get a little bit closer. Oh shit. Let's get down with it. Woohoo! Mabako Island. Absolutely fucking beautiful, man. So now we're hunting wildlife, which is also a nice little thing to do in this game. We got some iguanas hunting and crafting. You can hunt animals and then skin them to collect animal goods. The resources allow you to craft new items and upgrades for Edward. You can use Eagle Vision to spot animals. The crafting menu can be axes from the pause menu. Ah, oh, disgusting. Come here. <laughs> this guy's a savage. This reminds me of Red Dead. Oh, there's another one here. I don't want to shoot them. Wouldn't that mess up the the pelt? I don't. I don't think he cares. But um, man, do you imagine if Rockstar made a pirate game? That would be crazy. Ocelots killed in the skin. Alright, so we need to find the ocelots. Okay, one. Let's go over here. Oh, there's also an eagle. Oh yeah! It's a little excessive for an ocelot, you know, but pirates will be pirates. Oh, shooter iguana is actually part of the. Uh... Okay, well, never mind then. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. That that should be a crime. Yeah, you see those? You can't you 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 can't kill them like that, unless they come to you. They're just too fast. Also, realize we've got a sink point here as well, which is nice. Okay, so craft a new holster, um, craft a health upgrade. Okay, health upgrade, sword sets, pistol sets, outfits, crafting, pistol holster. So this holster allows Edward to carry one additional pistol. All right, so that's when you do the bam, bam, right? The double, double wield or whatever. Projective gear increase Edward's health by 25. That's that's very nice. I will have that indeed. Are we done? Yes. Meet Adewale. Ahoy, Captain. Find what you need. My needs and wants are oceans apart, mate. But I did fashion myself a new holster. All I need now is a pistol to lie in it. How convenient. Taken from the holds, just as you said. A little more than a blowpipe. But they'll do. So, are we rested? Or should we idle a while longer? Best way, Anchor. I think the crew is itching to reach civilization. You'll find no civilization in NASA. But it's a fine place to be merry all the same. Mission complete. Okay. So the multi pistols press Y multiple times with pistols equipped to uh, equip to change shots. All right, so that's what I was trying to do earlier, and I completely forgot that those are like one shot pistols. I'm here thinking you can keep shooting them, but I oftentimes forget they were like 300 years ago, basically. Um, so these shots do less damage but interrupt attacks. Okay. Close down. Catch some wind. All right, bye-bye. 
Really like that island. Wait, did we ever get a sink point there? Wait, I never got the sink point. Hold on, did I never? I never unlocked the sink point. Oh, I'm an idiot. I am the biggest idiot of all. Hold on, I love this island. Of course I'm gonna sink up. That'd be really stupid. Man, look at the watercolor. I cannot, I literally, I even, I don't even know if I commented on it, but I definitely thought about it. And I just completely, look at the eagle there. I, I just completely didn't do it. What a fool. Something so simple. I just didn't do it. Simple yet effective. <laughs> is it is it up on the D-pad? To look at location? I think it is. I'm not. I pressed it, but nothing really happened. All right, so we got to set sail on. Is it on that side of the island? Let me look at the map and see where we are. We're here. It just keeps kind of glitching out. All right, so we got to go past this little island in between. Okay, so. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I think right here we can set sail. Perfect. Except Nassau. Travel to this location. I was actually really close to where we were at. Bahamas. Go on, Captain Queer Nubs. Tell me I'm under arrest. Tell me! Damn your breads. Fly away, boy. Oh, back to your master. Aye. We was privateers together before the wars ended. I'll see you ashore. So we're now in the Bahamas, which is excellent. This is great. Man, this game really is. I mean, I've said it already a couple of times. This game is really special. There's just so much to love and and we really don't have a lot of pirate games that allow you to do as much as you can do in this game considering how old the game really is this is still a sensational not only pirate game but assassin's creed game it is good in so many so many categories personally speaking obviously all these things are you know subjective or whatnot so might like it so might not but i i really enjoy it but I think we'll end it here. I, I wanted to thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed yourselves. This was a revisiting Assassin's Creed Black Flag sort of video. I don't have intentions to do this or make this into a series. Obviously, if you guys really have a high demand, then maybe we can. But, um, wow, look at the water. Maybe we can. I don't know. But nonetheless, we came, we saw, we conquered, and I had a blast. Hopefully you guys did as well. And thank you for watching. I'll catch you later.